Jason J. Mac McElwain continues to recover from serious injuries after a bicycle crash earlier this month. But he got out of the hospital this week. New tonight at 5, Patrick Musinak talked to J. Mac to see how he's doing. Patrick? Brett, as bad as the accident turned out, J. Mac is actually in good spirits taking things day by day. The best part is he's home and looking forward to his future plans. I'm doing a little better every day. There's some pains at certain movements, but I'm, uh, but I'm okay. Jason McElwain, also known as J-Mac, is finally out of the hospital and has the freedom to do what he wants to do once again. That I'm able to go see people without having to uh, report back to the hospital or uh, just like freedom to socialize again and see people. On June 13th, J-Mac was on his way to work as a bus monitor for Greece Central Schools when he crashed his bicycle into a car on Long Pond and Ladder Roads. He broke several ribs and suffered a collapsed lung. He says he doesn't remember the accident at all, but is dealing with the experience. Says it puts life into perspective. Don't take any, any day for granted. Um, don't take any wake up for granted. Don't take any... Um, any day that you hit that you're able to walk for granted in high school j mac was a basketball manager for greece athena during his senior year he became a national celebrity after sinking six three-pointers in one game and scoring 20 points altogether it was his first and only game he says he has some immediate plans number one is to continue his recovery he shared what else he has in store stop by some basketball camps and speak at those um and do physical therapy and uh, get my daily walks in and, uh, and go to my church, Faith Bible Church. J-Mac wanted to share one last message. Grateful for the Rochester area for all the support. While in the hospital, J-Mac was encouraged when doctors and nurses would talk to him about basketball and the game that made him famous. Brett? 